diabetic Liam is here with his grandmother, Mary. Hiya, Liam. I'm Laurie. I'm one of the doctors. I think we met before, have we? You were in a few days ago. Um, how are you doing at the moment? Oh, I'm in uh, OK, mate. So, we've checked your blood sugars and your ketones, and you've got a problem with your diabetes again. So, diabetic, diabetic ketoacidosis, by the signs of it. Diabetic ketoacidosis is a very serious medical condition. Patients generally come in very unwell, very dehydrated, fast heart rates, can cause a lot of tummy pain. Liam has struggled to control his diabetes since his mother passed away. Mum recently passed away. Christmas Day, two years since. And, well, she died with heart troubles. And then when they told us she was dying, she just says to me, what happened with that, I'll leave him. I says, I'll look after him and I have done. Yeah. What, what she, well, is mum your daughter? Mm. So you're still uncomfortable, aren't you? Any pain around your back at all? Despite being given insulin, Liam's sugar levels are not dropping. Dr Malloy is concerned there may be more to the condition than he first thought. There's not like a long-running history of infection or anything that makes me think it would be sepsis, but I think if there's any significant derangement in his blood, then I need to consider that. Liam's sugar levels are still so unstable, his body is now going into shock. Unless Dr. Malloy can bring the diabetes under control in the next few hours, Liam's life remains at risk. In recess, 20-year-old diabetic Liam is still suffering with severe abdominal pain. Do you want to give yourself your insulin? His dad, Andrew, has come to be with him. So, the plan at the moment, he came in, had really high sugars, no high ketones like he's had before, which is what your, your body produces when you can't get the sugar into your cells. Bloods, they were, weren't great to start with, to be honest, um, but they are slowly improving. Um, so, I think we should be able to get him up to a acute medical unit. So, ketones are three now, which is a lot better. Liam remained in hospital for nine days. His insulin levels eventually returned to normal and his pain subsided. <laughs>